that Aaron was taken away, he was arrested in handcuffs. Uh, I guess we all expected that. Uh, my whole thoughts about Aaron go back to when he was in high school. Before that, when he was just a standout athlete, his dad would always bring him here to the Bristol Press when he was picked as athlete of the week, bring him here to talk to me, and the same with DJ. And dad was always there with him. Dad was always there with him. Uh, when dad had the hernia in 2006, he was in the hospital. The Bristol Press had a picture of Dennis in bed, and I believe it was after the operation, with his two sons standing by his side. And you could just, you could just sense the love they had for one another, the, the three, the respect they had for their dad and vice versa. So I, I got to know Dennis more and got to know the kids more through Dennis. Uh, I don't know them as well as the people up at Central. But when Aaron became an All-American, got drafted by uh, the Patriots, and signed a $41 million co contract. He was Bristol's golden boy, and I, and I bragged about him. He was, he was the number one thing about Bristol, going for Bristol at the time. So it's disappointing uh, as to what's been happening now. And I, I pray for the victim's family, I pray for Aaron's family, and I hope, I know that there's, there's gotta be some connection for them to arrest him. And I'm hoping maybe, perhaps he knows the He's, he's associated, perhaps, with whoever did the killing, but I'm hoping Aaron was not part of it, had nothing to do with it. But in my mind, I think the people that did it uh, have associated with Aaron, regardless if he's involved or not. And that's, I'm praying for that. And I'm praying that, uh, I know, uh, supposedly he destroyed his cell phone in his uh, security assistant home. And, I, and, and me being uh, naive, I'm hoping it wasn't him, but it was maybe the, the associates or whatever. I don't know. Uh, again, I pray for everybody, and uh, this blows my mind, and I'm sure everybody in Bristol. He was, he was our number one bragging rights, and you hate to see this happen. And again, until uh, this whole thing's cleared up, uh, I do wish him well. I do, however, hope that whoever did the killing gets what they deserve. And I, I truly hope it's not Aaron that has any part of it.